This is an important question. What is your view of introducing psychedelics uh, to children and the initiation of children into altered states? Uh, this is so controversial, so hot, that r other than reading the question, <laughs> I'm not sure what I could say. Uh, at the Bridge Conference at Stanford a few weeks ago, there was a woman's panel. Um, Kat was on it, Carolyn Garcia, uh, Cindy Palmer Horowitz, Nina Gravoy, some of the great psychedelic women. and. Uh, this is very important to discuss. Some of you may have read Odd John by Robert Bly, where he makes a tremendous case that fathers should provide initiatory experiences for their children. And, you know, we're not talking an overnight trout fishing trip here, <laughs> folks. Um, I, I think this definitely needs to be discussed. I'd be more comfortable with women discussing it because I think women are the caregivers and the child rearers uh, largely. But it's really a problem. I mean, it's a problem for us that we even do these things in a climate of legal intolerance. And then, you know, to put it on to our children, to make criminals of our children. You know, I mean, you can lose your children with a stunt like that. This is very touchy, and yet I see it as a First Amendment right. It's a, ma a matter of religious conviction. Uh, uh, and I don't know, my hope is that someday this religious conviction issue is going to collide right into the psychedelic issue, uh, because I do not see how we can live under a constitution that guarantees life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness and say that psychedelic drugs are illegal. I mean, if the pursuit of happiness means anything, it must cover that. Now, I've had constitutional scholars explain to me that, well, no, you don't understand. Hamilton wanted it to say life, liberty, and the right to own property, <laughs> and Jefferson uh, objected. So they decided they'd put in language that was meaningless. So they settled on the pursuit of happiness. But I say, let's take that meaningless language in the Constitution and turn it into the greatest social revolution that's ever been seen. Ch children and psychedelics.